planet versus plastic. It's the new call to arms for this Earth Day 2024. By the way, today is Earth Day. It's calling for a 60% reduction in plastic use by 2040. According to the UN Environment Program, humans produce 400 million tons of plastic waste each year. One way to help reduce that amount is by trying to avoid buying groceries packed in plastic packaging. A million plastic bottles bought every minute. Five trillion plastic bags used worldwide every year. Half of all plastic produced designed for single-use purposes. These are just some of the worrying statistics from the UN Environment Program that warns that plastic is now part of the Earth's fossil record and a marker of our current geological era. Consumers need to know that most plastics are not recyclable. Only 5 to 6 percent of plastics are recyclable in the United States. So your key tip is to try to avoid plastic wherever you can. Judith Ank is the former Environmental Protection Agency Regional Administrator and president of the advocacy group Beyond Plastics. None of us woke up one day and said, gee, I want to buy more plastic packaging. And I don't think anything tastes good in plastics. Um, but we need to get rid of the guilt, do the best we can, and then work for policy changes. She suggests starting small at the grocery store. Keep reusable shopping bags in your car and steer clear of packaged carrots and lettuce, which she says are kept in plastic coffins. It's really convenient to have those little pre-cut carrots, but I like to buy carrots with no packaging and you just wash them and cut them up yourself and they actually taste much fresher and are cheaper than the plastic bags of carrots. She encourages taking action rather than just feeling guilty about the state of our planet. Plastics, by the way, account for 85% of marine litter, and the most common are food wrappers, plastic bottles, and um, shopping bags. <laughs> They're so common that a plastic grocery bag has been found in the Mariana Trench, the deepest yeah. point in the ocean. Wow, that's so sad. I mean, you know, I try to reuse them, mm -hmm. you know, for different things. Do, yeah. You know, I think about that. But then I also have been shopping at Aldi, so they don't give you bags, right. and that's making me be more conscientious yeah, of and it. And you know what? You, you, that's an interesting point. You go to some stores like Target, yeah. they will give you a credit if you don't use don't a shopping use bag. A bag. Yeah, so yeah even if it's too. five cents, I mean, it's worth it. So, what are some other things that we can do day to day to help? Yeah, you know, there's small things. Um, UN says that plastic pollution could be slashed by 80% by 2040 if countries make significant policy shifts, and that includes promoting reuse options like you were talking about, mm -hmm. refillable bottles, uh, systems, and, and deposit return programs. Remember, when I was a kid, you know, if you took the glass bottle, you returned it. Yeah, you, back you, then got, you got a yeah, nickel. You got, yeah. I'm telling you, I always have my recyclable yeah. cup, and I don't use plastic water bottles. It just doesn't taste the same either. No, it doesn't. I, I think in some states, like uh, up north, uh, New England, they still give you money back if you mm -hmm. return the bottles. I'm not yeah. sure about that. Whatever it takes. Yeah. I mean, we all have to do our part to help this We do. Earth. It's, it's our planet Earth, and there are things that we can do to make a difference mm -hmm. and, and save the Earth. Yeah, I, I, for it's future an old generations. Slogan, but